Now, this video on your view, I woke up to it <laughs> and I'm amazed. Now, this doctor right here, I think he's on TVC. I'm going to play the video. This doctor right here is supporting adolescent knocking. This has been proven. So, this, this uh, erection, yes. up to what age? If you are 80, Fantastic. are you supposed to? My oldest that? patient is 92. He has a four year old daughter, DNA proven. This is not somebody that swapped. Not by IVF. Not by IVF. The so, ability for a man to wake up with an erection has nothing to do with age. It's all about blood flow. If mm. your heart, if your heart is pumping, some men woke up today. They're talking. They're alive, but they cannot raise their left hand because they're stroke. No blood flow. If I wake up and this guy doesn't wake up, uh, there's problem. He said this guy. The guy. Not say. There's problem. So. <laughs> So we, okay, we, have, to, we have to get out of it. I have a color. Uh, uh, okay, you have a color. This, I have a question. This show is preparing your body like this. <laughs> a day from London. Thanks <laughs> for calling. Okay, good morning. I'm enjoying that doctor. I'm sure you I are. Have a mm. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I have a question for the doctor. My question is that what are the faith of the Catholic priest who doesn't get married? Thank you very much, sir. An excellent question. And they did long. They live long. Wait now. They did a study. They also consider truth and clarity in a world so loud. Searching for light, guided by truth, will make it right. With faith as our shield, we take a stand. They are nuns. They look at nuns, and they were looking at eighty thousand nuns, and they looked at the people that were sexually active. This has to do with women, because the nuns that have never had sex at all, they had the highest risk of breast cancer, ovarian cancer, and cervical cancer. So for the men, we're looking at how to even access them. Because whether you believe it or not, why are the Catholic churches settling? Because all these people are doing things behind the door. Mm. Honestly, that is just the truth. So let's get out of the old society, the conservative thing. Because we need to really face the reality. Your question earlier was about your daughter and your son and saying, look, we tell them in church, stay, abstain, do this, yeah. do that. They looked at sexually active young girls their risk of breast cancer is almost zero. What you and I should be paying attention to is when is my daughter starting her menses? If she starts her menses before the age of 12, you are carrying 30% risk of breast cancer, whether you are there or not. Mm. And the same thing goes for your son. If your son is not getting rid of his DHT, trust me, I'm not wishing it on him, but it's going to develop enlargement of the prostate. See, All right, so society is... I have a question. Wait, 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 wait. wait, 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 wait. Let me ask you. Ask, wait, that's what sex is at all. I wanted to ask because <laughs> I hear all this. Yes. I, I am um, 80, 90 percent in agreement yes, with you. I, I don't, I can't argue with you. But in this day and age of sexually transmitted diseases, excellent question. Yeah. You are telling men to go out and have sex. They will go and catch what they should not catch. Yes, yes. No, I agree with you, and that's where we talked about society awareness and all that. So at Heritage Men's Clinic, we, t we treat STIs. Yeah, and and we, let people know that we, we let people know that, you know, <laughs> <laughs> we let people know that the condom is not even 100% protected, but we advise it. But the other part of the society you and I are not talking about, some men, because I do advocacy in other countries, they are telling us that the cost of condom is even too expensive compared to what they're going to pay the Olosho or pay the girl. Mm. So you know we, we have a bigger problem. Olo like it, leave it, like it, like it. Uh -uh. We have Who me, I know that one. Uh -uh, wait, please, go, please go ahead, I don't mind. So, we have, so, so we, have, we have a bigger problem on our hands. Mm. But the truth of the matter is, even the girl, whether contracted or not, she does not want to carry diseases. So yeah. the men themselves, they are not going into the rain without raincoat. We advocate, we tell them, so when they come in, STI is part of what we do. Yeah. We check it. Because there are certain STIs that you and I may have and we do not even know. Mm. To avoid post -treat. It's also supporting that you marry as many, more, many wives that those with three wives, they live longer. Then he also talks about people who even complain that condom is more expensive than the Olosho they are carrying. He encourages you to go out there as a person and go and get knocked outside. I'm amazed because this is totally different. And this would mislead a lot of men. In as much as you feel getting married to as many women will make you comfortable, make you live long, I still do not feel it's true.
And then for the younger generation, it's going to also mislead them too. This is misleading and it's going to lead to a whole lot of chaos, especially in Africa, where we see record a lot of sicknesses, especially STIs and HIV. <laughs> As bad as it is, as it may sound, but this is not encouraging. And I still say no to this. But I know a lot of people, is getting, they're going to embrace it because of their high libido. They say if you even shook the table of Catholic priests, that the women who has never had anything to do with a man, they have the higher, higher risks of breast cancer. Why they couldn't even... <laughs> the men... They are hiding to do things. That means the Catholic priest. So they couldn't even get a number. Please, let my mouth not go. You say, Father, be a beer bone. This doctor shaking a lot of tables. And let me know what you think about it in the comment section. Especially for this teenage knocking. I, I still do not appreciate it. I don't support it. What do you think in the comments? Truth and clarity in a world so loud, searching for light, guided by truth, will make it right. With faith as our shield, we take a stand for wisdom and clarity, hand in hand. Truth and clarity with Ejero, we see.